that's going to sting a little. I started playing when I was five. My earliest memory was riding the bicycle around um, the park courts where my parents were taking lessons. The guy who was training before them would take me round and put cones out and uh, yeah, I'd try hit them as targets. My dad, he was always involved in my tennis from a very young age. When I was younger, we would always compete against each other and I'd always want to beat him. And when that day finally came when I was older, um, yeah, it was, it was great. I'd say playing Battle of the Brits, it was such a great atmosphere. Managed to sneak a couple wins, uh, one against Andy, which I was really pleased about. Just the whole atmosphere was, was great to be a part of. For me, I don't think about my age too much. I like to focus on putting my game out there and I think now is the best time for me because I am young. So I can use that to my advantage and go out and have a swing. But it was great to be uh, around them and, and play Heather, for example. Some shots I thought that weren't possible to hit, she clearly did them. So um, to take that away was a good learning for me. It's definitely helped us to stay match fit because when I first started the first British tour I was extremely rusty and to shake that rust off early doors is very beneficial and the LTA have done an absolutely amazing job of putting these events on for us. I'm most looking forward to traveling again. At the moment I'm, I'm still a little bit apprehensive about traveling. I love exploring new places and that's probably my favorite thing to do is, is just see what, what little hidden gems I can find in these different countries and places. To be top 10 and win slams, that's definitely up there. At the moment, I think I'm top five in my year and you know, that's a good achievement, but I want to like stay with them and if not top them. It's been very beneficial because tennis is an expensive sport. I think to have that support and backing is just great. It makes it a lot easier for us and we don't have to worry about having to cut any corners. It's definitely helped me uh, stay confident in my game, just having that reassurance. I'd say at a young age to make sure you have a, a fun environment and also not to put all of your eggs in one basket too early. I think that for me, I've stayed in, in full-time education even until now. Sometimes when you focus everything into tennis, you can get a little bit bored off court if, if there's nothing else going on. So just to keep your mind uh, activated in other, in other ways is, is I think is healthy.